Okay, so this is video two that I'm doing because it has been two weeks. Um, the 21st was my sixth month um, on hormones. Um, so I guess I need to do hormone effects. Um, and I was ha having fun. There goes Kevin laughing again. I was having fun um, talking with some old friend. Or, uh, actually one of my real close friends and I haven't seen her in like a year and a half two years either but um, this is a different one from one we see I actually went out to have drinks with her and she and you know and she's really interested in you know hormones am I more emotional I guess you know <sighs> there goes Vi laughing now <laughs> but uh, no, anyway, now I guess I can, people. Oh well, yeah, I guess I am more emotional, or my emotions are more apparent. I think, and that's kind of in a superficial sense. I think in a less superficial sense, my moods have actually kind of settled down. I'm more, a lot happier, and um, that's actually that came across, or that really came across. My friend Emily told me that I seemed a lot happier. Or two of my friends I haven't seen in a while. I said it seemed a lot happier and just a lot more relaxed and a lot more calm. And and I you know and and that is true. I mean, a lot of that I can't I can't say that's all hormones. I think a lot of that's also the, my social role fits who who I feel I am a lot better. So so that's a part of it. Um, now. Three months ago, so I met this one, um, a tranny at a bar, and she and she had been on hormones seven months. I thought she, she was gorgeous, actually. But um, I, you know, she was talking about how six months um, into hormones is when her think when she really began to think differently. And I don't know that I am thinking differently, but um, and the, and. Well, for, let me back up and say, um, I was pretty convinced before starting hormones, and I think it, 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 you pretty much are pretty convinced before you start hormones that you should start hormones, that you are, I mean, I was pretty convinced that my mind is female, I should have estrogen, um, but I am a lot more sure of that now, because, it, like, some of the things, like, um, Actually, be really sincerely being physically attracted to someone is something that that is kind of new for me. That um, like before, I was vaguely. Attra I mean, it wasn't asexual, but like attractions towards people were always kind of vague, and like people would always talk about being attracted to someone, and it was always kind of something like I was always kind of not in the conversation um, because I think. The way my mind is, I think that my mind needed estrogen in order to be able to develop sexually, and um, so that's kind of like that's actually like a big thing. So I'm a, a lot more um, sexual, and that was that is not something they tell you. They say your libido is going to drop, and in a sense, but now now I say that it's, I get a lot less erections, and quite honestly, thank God because I. Don't enjoy them, um, and my sexuality, my developing burgeoning, bur whatever sexuality is, um, not centered around my abnormal, well, my normal naughty bits for a guy, but my my abnormally large naughty bits. Um, so this is this is such a ridiculous vlog. So anyway, that was like I wanted to say that's one thing, and like it, like I kind of started find myself really a lot more attracted to women than I ever was before. I was attracted to women as a guy, and I still I still think I am. But I'm like what going back to where I was talking about six months, you you start to the way you think starts to change, and I don't think I'm thinking differently, but I'm finding myself questioning more and more recently whether I'm really attracted to women or not and that is um, it's kind of scary but uh, I mean that's just something you accept maybe I'm straight you know 
I come across this pretty anyway. But um, let's see, physical changes. Well, look at my arms. My arms look pretty feminine. My face is a lot softer. Um, I think my face shape has changed a lot. I, you, I, my first vlog, I'd already been on hormones for months. I don't know if my face shape has changed. My voice um, hasn't, although, although just it has. I haven't really put a lot of work into it, but it's kind of you know it's how people expect me to talk or talk like that, and and I also found out that I was talking in a. Um, a lot lower than where my voice naturally falls. This is actually where my voice naturally falls. And it's low, but it's not real. It's not a man's voice. And, and I don't know. I, I don't know exactly what I'm doing. But I used to watch all these videos on developing a female voice. And I kind of think most people, I think most men and women, really their voices are within the same range. It's just it, it, more how you perceive your, your voice is how you sound. So that is, um, oh, and I, these are, I definitely have breasts at this point. They are, they are not stuffing, they are definitely breasts. And I love them. And, you know, and I look, in, look at them in the mirror, and honestly what I think when I see them, and it's just kind of, oh, thank God. Like, I, I don't know. So that's, I mean, I guess that's really what I can say about hormones. Um, I think they're a wonderful, wonderful thing. I really don't ever want to stop. Um, I won't stop. Like, there's no way I could ever stop. Um, then, um, it, you know, then, of course, you know, seeing my friend again, you know, because I'm meeting up with all my friends before I leave town. Um, and we, you know, it's really, it's just, it's just really interesting. It's, um, because I'm experiencing, experiencing something that most people don't experience, and I kind of wish I could, I'm sure there's a better way to share it with people, because I, I mean, the more, I, I've got an insight that most people don't have, and I think that's good. Um. Which is why I want to major in gender studies. Um, get a PhD in that. So, I guess um, this video is going to get like a lot of hits because it's my six months long on effect video. Um, so, I, yeah, I'm in a lot of stress. Um, wish me luck. And I will stop this and be done with it.